104.7 The Fish listeners, and Chick-fil-A, teaming up for another act of love. Hi, it's Beth Bacall. We're in Monticello, Georgia. At the beginning of the year when the pandemic hit, Larry Clark lost his wife, Judy. And just one month ago, he lost a grandson that he and Judy had been raising since he was two weeks old. So Stephen passed at the age of 35. Larry has also been diagnosed with lung cancer and he's driving a vehicle with no air conditioning. He's in a house that he needs to vacate that involves a lot of other family members that live with him within the next eight days. And he just doesn't have the means for all of this. When we heard Larry Clark's story, we knew that our really generous fish listeners, along with our friends at Chick-fil-A Atlanta, would agree that Larry needs a fish act of love. And that's what's about to happen. Come on. An absolutely beautiful family. Um, But I know behind those face masks that your hearts are really hurting. You've had a lot of loss this year. We're really sorry to hear about the loss of your wife, Judy, at the beginning of this pandemic. One month ago, a grandson that you raised since the w- two weeks old. They're dead. Yeah. You They're lost, dead. and then you also have your others that are living with you. What a generous man you are. Yeah, so it was a lot of change this past year, you know. Yeah. All well, they, but, and you have been diagnosed with lung cancer. Yes, ma'am. Uh, We're praying for your healing. Thank you. You know, she had been praying. That, uh, all of us is praying that God would do something for him because he's had so many dark days. You know, just stormy days. I said, please, Lord, just let him have a little sunshine. So much loss, but so much love with your entire family who you care for in this house, which I hear you need to be out of this house very soon so you can get everybody into a place that's safe, correct? Oh my. Well, there's one thing that never changes with the fish, and that is that we stand on the the fact that we know God is good at being God all the time. We are praying for your healing. Well, we have uh, some really generous listeners in a fish wish fund and our friends at Chick-fil-A Atlanta. So for your fish act of love, we would like to start with your grandsons. And we thought that if each of you had some brand new laptops for this year, that that would make your school year get off to a much better start than it just being a little different. Would that be good? Oh, thank you, Jesus. That would be good. <laughs> and we know that you've been driving in a vehicle with your air, with no air conditioning. No air conditioning. It ain't making as fast as two sliders. So much hardship, yet so much love your family represents. Yeah. So we did some calculations, and we figured that in order to get some air conditioning in your vehicle and to get your family packed up and moved to a place that was safe, that that would cost about $6,000. So on behalf of the Fish Wish Fund and our friend at Chick-fil-A Atlanta, we would like to give you the means to make a safe move for your family happen. We care about you. God loves you. And if your family can get into a space that's healthy, we believe you're all just going to thrive. So I'd also like to introduce to you our friend Chris from the Covington Chick-fil-A. Well, part of the fish in the Atlanta market, we're a great partner together. We like to give you, it's a cow, number one. <laughs> and then uh, we'll try to maybe supplement this a little later, but right now it's Chick-fil-A for a year. Oh, wow. so, uh, so hopefully that'll help. <laughs> We'd love to have you, and then we'd love to take care of y'all. Y'all just stay together and keep everything will take care of itself. God bless y'all. Clark family, on behalf of the Fish Wish Fund, 104.7 The Fish in Chick-fil-A, Atlanta, God bless you. Have a safe move. We're praying for your healing. Have a great school year, and enjoy all your Chick-fil-A. Thank y'all so much.